first off, you're the last English club left in Europe. What's your reaction to the Europa League draw today? Everyone could be difficult. But, uh, all of them, they are good teams. We were thinking which one could be the best for us in terms of the features that we have, the number of um, games that we have. Basel is not too far away. So maybe it was a good option, but just because that, not because the uh, team didn't have a good team. And I think they did well against Tottenham, so you can see that it's an offensive team, and I think they with intensity, and it will be tough, will be dangerous for sure. You've got, of course, another big game coming up on Sunday. I think it's your sixth game in 16 days. And you couldn't really have a tougher test than against a City team who've yet to concede a goal in the FA Cup. Yes, yeah, a good team. They are in a good position in the table and uh, they did well against United the other day, so we know that uh, it's difficult, but it's a semi-final of the FA Cup, a massive competition, and we will try to do our best. We know uh, what we did uh, wrong when we play against them, we'll try to do well these things today or on Sunday. What are our City's strengths? What makes them such a great team? I think it's a very good team, very good squad, with a manager with experience and good managers, so they have a lot of uh, good things and confidence at the moment, so we know that uh, we have to do our best if we want to progress. And how much of an advantage is it for them that they haven't had to play this week, you've gone to Moscow and had to come back? It's always an advantage, I don't know how much, but uh, we're trying to uh, to manage our squad and uh, team selection and we have uh, players uh, with some fresh legs, so hopefully we will be fine and we have to do it in the same way until the end of the season. We have uh, too many games and we have to use the squad and everybody has to be on their toes. In, in a sense, there's still everything left to play for. How do you assess the way your squad has coped with playing so many games in such a short period of time recently? I think that they are doing really well. Uh, yesterday and today I was uh, pressing them because uh, they are working very hard today. Oh, just to show it, you could see Ferreira has to play as a left full back. He wasn't playing for a while. AK, a young player, but uh, all the players that they were playing, Yossi, uh, Moses, and they were working very hard. And then you can change players and still you can keep a good level. So really pleased uh, for them and for us. I think this will be your 59th game of the season. Um, Roy Hodgson said yesterday this whole debate about club v country you seem to suggest that some players weren't taking international friendly seriously enough. Do you think players are being asked to play too many international games, too many meaningless international games? Too many games in a season. I, don't, I will not say international or, or which kind of games, but uh, they are playing too many games in a season, yes. How would you like that to change though? What, what's the solution? Reducing the number of games, simple. So you have too many games, you have to check the competitions and maybe reduce some of them. International friendlies would probably be the first. I think that to see a game uh, when you can win 8-0 at uh, national, international level is not an amazing experience for anyone. So I think that uh, you have to have a Group A, the top side in Europe, and Group B, and if they uh, do well, they can go to the Group A, you have uh, less games. So you think there's too many sort of smaller countries involved in the qualifying tournaments at the moment? You'd like to see that cut? No, I have the, the feeling of the teams that they are not at the level that they like to do this and they say, OK, it's an opportunity for us. But uh, at the same time, you have a lot of groups. When I was uh, younger, one time ago, you had uh, less games, less teams, and you play. Normally, we're playing Spain, Italy, France, uh, Germany or England. But you want to play against the other teams because they have to play between them and after, if you're good enough, you go. So you have the divisions in the, in England, in Spain, in Germany, you have first division, second division, third division, it has to be the same. Can you give us the latest, please, on who's like to play on Sunday, Ben Baba? Ben Baba was training today, so I see that was fine. It was a light training session, but it was training. <coughs> Romero, Cahill, and Ashley Go. They will not be available, obviously. And uh, Bertrand, that was uh, sick the other day, has been training. Again, light training session, but he seems that he's, he's doing well. So, no big things uh, uh, yesterday, so I, I think that 
and they will be available, all of them, for Sunday.